Welcome to Ignite, a management event hosted by Center for Management. We have with us today Ms. Shaza Robinson. Welcome to Ignite, ma'am. Thank you. Uh, ma'am, what does it t what according to you does it take uh, for an individual to make it big in the in industry? Passion, totally passion. If there's no passion, you can't make it big in anything. If you follow always what your heart says and what your passion says, whether you're in business or whether you're in um, working in an NGO like I am, or whether you're simply a housewife and you're a, I won't say simply a housewife, but you're looking after children. If you have a passion about that, then you make it big, whatever big may mean to you, but you will be a success in what you're doing. Uh, Ma'am, can you give us some advice how to maintain work-life balance? Take care of yourself for a start. You know, often people, especially in business, they start working like seven o'clock in the morning and they don't finish till nine, ten o'clock at night and they think they have to do that. Well, we only have that we know of one life. Mm. And if we don't take care of ourselves, then we will have a very short life and not a very enjoyable life. When you go to your grave, you don't end up saying, wow, I had such a great time at the office, you know? Yeah. It's more like, yeah, I had a good time with my children, I had a good time with my wife, I enjoyed my sports, I enjoyed uh, my meditation, I, I balanced my life. And it's incredibly important to balance your life in so many different ways, right? From your physical self to your emotional being and to your spiritual self. And your business side will reflect that when you're balanced. So what is your advice on the spiritual enhancement of an individual? I would say that in whatever your belief system is, in whatever your spiritual leaning is, that probably one of the most important things that I've learned in my life is the importance of meditation. And it doesn't matter what form of meditation you use, whether you do it for half an hour, one hour, three hours, but the short time when you find in your meditation that you are connected to the whole is the most important time and if that is only five minutes it gives you that understanding that we are not alone and from that understanding many many things can happen so meditation essentially is probably one of the most important things that we can do in our lives so uh, what advice would you give us to us CFM students the future entrepreneurs. Yeah. Follow your passion. Yeah. Take time out and take time out to meditate. Learn to meditate if you don't know how to do that already. Okay. And that would be the three most important things that I could say. And the other is forget about competition and understand that at this time community and working in a team is the most important thing that you can do. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, it was a pleasure having you with us. Thank you.